What do you mean? The catcher in the rye. You know, the assignment from Mrs. Parker's class. Don't tell me you forgot. Oh my god. <laughs> Honestly, thank god. I thought I was alone. I mean, I didn't forget. But I'm terrible at reading. Like, this is so long.
the prostitute. How did we get here? If there's one thing I hate, it's the movies. Don't even mention them to me. Yeah, yeah, sure. Grab a blankie. It's pretty cold, isn't it? Anyway. <sighs> Page two. <sighs> Why I want to start telling is the day I left Pansy Prep. Pansy Prep is this school. probably heard of it. Um, no. You've probably seen the ads anyways. Um, still no. They advertise in about a thousand magazines. Always showing some hot shot guy on a horse jumping over a fence. Like as if all you have play polo all the time. I never even once saw a horse anywhere near that place. And underneath the guy on the horse's picture, it always says, since 1888, we have been molding young boys into splendid, clear thinking young men. Don't ask me about the accent, I just thought it was appropriate. for the birds. They don't do any damn more molding at Pansy than they do at any other school. What birds? And I didn't know anybody there that was splendid and clear thinking and all. Maybe two guys, if that many. And they probably came to
and just giggling or something. Old Selma Verma, because she was the headmaster's daughter, showed up at the games quite often. She was a pretty nice girl though. I sat next to her once in the bus from Hackers Dam. What a weird word. And we sort of struck up a conversation. I liked her. She had a big nose. <laughs> and her nails were all pinned down and bleedy looking. And she had on those damn falsies that point all over the place. But you felt sort of sorry for her. What I liked about her, she didn't give you a lot of horse manure about what a great guy her father was. She probably knew what a phony slob he was. <laughs> the reason I was standing way up on the bumps and nail instead of going instead of down at the game was because I just got back from New York. around 2.30 instead of around dinner time. The whole, what is that word? The whole team ostracized like an ostrich. Me with the whole way back on the train. It was pretty funny in a way. What was an ostrich doing? Yes, but 
cigars. He got cigars from Brazil. This book is pretty enigmatic so far. Yeah, it's a new word I learned today. I'm trying to use it. Enig enigma. En enigma. You're just missing.
stuff. 